Another benefit of a group structure or holding company structure uh, is that you can then look at risky investment strategies uh, and have them obviously ring fenced in a separate company. This could be let's say if you're doing service accommodation, you might want to do commercial conversions, new builds, or speculative planning opportunities. So you want to keep that in a different company because it's more risky or it's different, uh, and you don't want to jeopardize all the other operations. So from that point of view, it helps you to mitigate that risk as well, but it enables you to venture out and try different things.